Mama Africa is really calling back his children. Yes, you know where yes. I am? Where are we now? We're in the Gambia. The smiling coast of Africa. And yeah. I met this brother right here. And um, he actually approached me. And I thought, no, this guy is not Gambian. Where are you from? I said, I'm an African. African? I mean, he's an African-American. Nice to meet you, brother. Nice to meet you, too. Good to see you. Yes, yes. What brought you to the smiling coast of Africa? Well, it's just, you know, I, I, I um, visited and I just fell in love, man. Yes. Yeah, you visited and you fell in love. Yes, yes. Let's let's move. Let's let people see how beautiful this place is. And then when was the first time that you visited Gambia? Uh it's about maybe three years ago. Three years ago. Yeah, so I've been visiting and Wow. Yeah. And then finally you decided to move back in here. Yes, yes. How is the experience like so far? Oh, it's it's, it's great, man. It's it's you know, these are the type of places that I come and hang out in. So, you know, wow. my my Gambia, is, it, it might be different from what other people are used to, but, you know, there's plenty of resorts like this where you can come hang out and eat, yeah. go swimming, and, you know, you got the beach here. You know. beach in, yeah. in general, how will you describe Gambia? Like, let, let's say in three words, how will you describe Gambia? Well, it's, it's a very peaceful place. Um, you know, I mean, like where I'm coming from, America, I mean, a lot of people from the outside looking in, they don't understand, like, the, uh, like you know, we have gun violence and, yeah. you know, big uh, prison problems. You know, a lot of the black population are going to prisons and stuff and yeah. the opportunities, racism. I mean, it's just so much stuff going on. And when I visited here, you know, it's just like, oh, this is an option. You know, it's an option. You know, you, you don't have to stay. It, don't, it doesn't matter where you live in the world. You don't have to stay there. Exactly. You know, you can travel and, you know, it's a lot of people from Europe here, black Europeans, you know, but so a lot of people. Uh, they, they, they say America is the land of what? Milk and honey. Why would you leave the land of milk and honey to come settle down in a country like Gambia? Well, I, I would agree. I mean, I love America. I'm not I'm not like it's not like I'm, I'm never going back. I'm always going back and forth. So, I mean. Yeah. But it's just something new, you know. Okay. Uh, I mean, America, we have beaches and stuff that you can go. You know, I've been all around America. Yeah. So it's just kind of, it, it, everybody's black here. You know, it's just like, <laughs> you know, you see you have people just, yeah. it's very peaceful here. The people, they, they, they're, they're very welcoming. Yeah. So, so you, you just wanted to feel at home. That's the word you use. Because well, uh, yeah, yeah. And everyone around you looks like you. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> wow, I'm really enjoying this conversation with you. But I want to know, uh, being an African American in Africa, do you think there's difference between like an African living on the continent and you being an African American? Do you see any difference, any similarities that you see between Africans and African American? Similarities? Like in terms of, do you see yourself as being different on the continent? Or do you see yourself that you have the same similarities with somebody from Gambia since you're living with them? Yeah. Well, there's there's things that make us different, which is, I mean, I think the number one thing is going to be uh, religion. So, of course, this is this is a Muslim country. So uh, I, I actually um, I don't have a problem with it, but it's that's that's one difference, of, of course. The, the 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 economy yeah. is like you know American money, uh, euros, all of that stuff. It goes a long way here, so that's an advantage that any anybody coming from uh, around the world to here. I mean, your your money instantly just goes high ten times. You know? <laughs> yeah, so wow. that's amazing. So which means that cost of living is very low. Exactly. Yeah. Wow. Amazing. Exactly. Amazing. Since you live in Gambia right mm -hmm. now. Like definitely, I know you're investing in here, mm -hmm. investing in the business in here. Mm -hmm. Can you explain a little bit how is investment in here? Is it easy to invest in Gambia? Uh, it's, it's very easy. It's very easy. How um, easy it is? Well, I mean, you have to uh, find your market. Okay. And um, you you want to uh, do your research. You know, it's it's a lot of horror stories out there. People coming to any any part of Africa, okay. trusting people too much and giving 
So you want to come and do your research and uh, link with the right people. Exactly. As I said, link with people who are already on the ground. As I said, I know a lot of respectable people uh, here that'll help you get land. They'll help you start any type of business you want to do. So it's, just, it's really that simple. simple. It's, it's just uh, meeting with the right people. I actually have, uh, I can help people travel here. Uh, if you go to Gambia Connect, on Instagram, you know, make sure you follow that page. That that page actually showcases a lot of the beauty here. So make sure you follow me on Gambia Connect. Uh, so I can actually help you if you're coming into Gambia. And of course, we have guys like RJ. He's yeah, in Senegal. Senegal yeah. And, you know, I, like I said, I'm just getting started. So I want to meet with everybody who's, yeah. I mean, of course, we have a lot of black Americans exactly. in Ghana. Yeah. So it's really no excuse for black Americans. I mean, there's literally people that are already here that can help you, help make your, your experience a lot easier, you know. I wanna say thank you so much for talking to me. And um, you all should go follow this brother, go support the movement. It's all about Africa to the world. But since we are in Gambia, it's all about Gambia to the world. So boy, Mr. Ghana, baby, and I'm out. Peace out.